Safe community water systems and water safety plans are important ways to ensure the good health of a community because water is a fundamental human need. It is a fundamental human right. Each person on earth requires at least 20 to 50 liters of clean, safe water a day for drinking, cooking and simply keeping themselves clean. Improved safety in water supply and better management of water resources can boost communities' economic growth and can contribute greatly to public health. This is Ezio Bodo Mungo in our local government area, located in south part of Enugu State. These people are predominantly farmer and hard-working individuals. Being located amidst the Ogushio's bentiminous coals with oil deposits. And amidst all its blessings, access to clean waters become a huge challenge to their daily activities. We are having a lot of challenges as far as water is concerned. We move far and near to get water. If you get there to get the water, the water will, be, will not be clean. I would do if I do to me, I do in Kembo. Kembo, if I got, if I not buy you, a man we are half, and you do quarter, or you say half. Why get this in Keto? I follow very good. It is very, very stressful. Then, see now, I feel my can on a bow. Sometimes, oh no, come and do open. Jet a afternoon. Anything that my mommy told me to come back to the village, I used to tell her, no, because because of the challenges we have with water, going to the stream, all the way to the stream, to go and fetch water, it's not even something of here and here. You have to trek very, very deep, passing all the bushes before you get water. Most of our like borehole. They have not been functioning very well in this our town community. So have well, deep wells. There's no sun dry in the dry season. A lot of people have to cross the extra and know the danger associated with it. Some go as far as going to in, 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 uh, the next village to get water. And those waters are not even hygienic enough. Their challenges regards to having clean water became a thing of the past through the help of concerned individuals of the community, built a water scheme in the health center. The message of providing portable water to us came with a lot of joy. The whole community was excited about it. And we were hoping that at the end of this exercise, we will see portable water. It's a thing of joy. There are some groups that came before, but they didn't fulfill their mission. Now, you see that there are pipes laid out lay for, for people to fetch water. Words can't even qualify how people feel, especially the elderly ones living around. People around here are enjoying it. Not only just having water, but also giving our people job opportunity. The painter, the technician, Mr. Kama, is from my village, Ezioha. I'm one of the persons who benefited by doing the plumbing work of this place. Some people did tie, some people did uh, some missing work. Bringing us in shows that, yes, we want us to belong. Who we belong now can now help to co coordinate people to come and say that the management of this place will be done, will be well done as well. For such a laudable project, there must be a sustainability plan. The union will sit back and how do we maintain this? How do we put sanity in the usage? How the security aspect of it? Maybe when we are start taxing ourselves to make sure we sustain the project. After a detailed process of getting clean water was applied for a couple of weeks by the contractors, The water scheme project was ready and set for commissioning. November last year, 
Reverend Father Dominic Mba, all over Canada. Oh, for him, see me. No, we don't need the doctor. He needs more milk. Philip and Ellie. And I hope so. Honorable Barrister, the Dutch community, I'll be the Vice Chairman of Oak Group. We are representing the Chairman of Oak Group. I am Petro Oak. Having been invited to commission and pass this day, we have done the top of it. I'm very happy because what seemed to be impossible was made possible and uh, the people of my community are very appreciative of it. What I want to tell the donors is that that the God I'm worshiping will be blessing him or her. I got three hammer, more, more, more. Obey the motor, honor some poena, poena. May they fill their pockets with abundant blessing. Njamun, Njau, Njamun. Obede mama hotunu tiwe bia tinye bohola obedo kwa manwere nneke nekulu na yu numero Thank you very much <laughs>